All right, so we're talking about healing. This is the second part in a series called Healing and Wholeness. And I was reading something this morning that was very inspiring for me. It's a return healing to our original state of purity or wholeness, the integrity of being. And in order to do that, it says in this book I was reading, The Revealing Word, that all healing begins with cleansing the mind, cleansing the energy field in which you live and move and have your being, that you live in the original purity or integrity of your wholeness, your original state of being. And then when the mind and the heart is healed, when your energy field is cleansed of error thinking, or let's say disruptive vibrations of energy, then you return to this vital state of aliveness that is in flow and in balance and in alignment and harmony with the whole universe, with the love of God, with the perfection of the universe, the inherent intelligence that is in every cell of your body, which is in every possible particle of the universe physical and every possible part of the universe energetically. That means that this flow of energy is now moving through you and it's clearing out all the blocks to your perfect alignment with all that is. And that is going to be your return to wholeness. Healing is a return to wholeness. And I'm so grateful at Unity that this is one of the main uh, focal points of our teaching. This is a focus of our mind. Our intention is to heal not only ourselves, but all of humanity through remembering who we are and returning to that integrity of being. And so this is where we sit today in the wholeness and the perfection of the universe, one with you, one with God, one with all that is, and knowing that we are healed, we are whole, and we are perfect in the flow of our original purity. And so it is. Amen. Amen.